very minimal. Very minimal. You want to you want to get it on the water? Yes. Well, you still want to race? No, no, we're done racing. We're done. We're not going to compete today. Yes. There is an, another race today for OMC and yeah, multi-hole, yeah? Yeah. No, no they cancelled it? Uh, I would imagine since almost all the competitors are on the beach or not able to go sailing. Looks like you're going to on the beach. Okay. So what are you going to do instead? We're going to work on the boat, put it away, and we'll have a beer. Yeah, we have beers again! Kevin, I think the most important thing is, is anyone injured, missing? No, as far as uh, we know at this stage, there's uh, no injuries uh, and no serious injuries, I should say, and, uh, and uh, yeah, no one missing, so just boats have washed up on the beach. The combination of a westerly and the tide going out, people were anchored quite show, close to shore. When exactly did the main sort of uh, chaos start? What time? It started about 3, 3.30 in the morning. Wow. And when did people... It wasn't, it wasn't really chaos, but the, the, the westerly, it's uh, one boat broke loose. So did you have to get up early and where were you at that time? Uh, yeah, they have been up for a while, so... Well, obviously people on board the boats too, yeah? Were they the first ones to... Uh, uh, no, actually, uh, we uh, when we saw the wind coming in, uh, a few of us got up and looked. We got some calls from some of the boats. Right. Are the authorities helping? Have we got any? Um, the authorities are helping. Uh, uh, right here is a Royal Thai Navy uh, uh, boat, which uh, unfortunately got washed up on the beach as well. But uh, they've just fixed the engine. They're going back out to uh, take people to their boats. Right. Well, what about the program? Are you going to have the sail passed? And you're going to have yeah. your new today. Uh, of races. In, in interest of safety and in light of what's happened, we've uh, cancelled and abandoned all the racing for today. And the sail pass, obviously. And the sail pass. Yeah. Will it be rearranged for tomorrow? Perhaps? No, or? probably, probably not. Probably, uh, you know, the, the regatta itself. We actually finished the racing yesterday, so we have a full regatta already. So, in that sense, Pat, you're lucky. In that you, sense, uh, perhaps, we're, perhaps we're lucky. Yeah. But we would have had enough races anyhow even without today, uh, you know, they, we really only require five races to complete a series. Right. Um, but next year you will still go ahead with the new categories of this uh, IRC and, and a multi hole We're still not certain how the organization will be next year in terms of the final day like this or whether it will be a full week of racing. It's still being discussed. And you've been racing yourself? Um, how, how's your week gone? I've uh, been, okay, uh, a little bit middle to back of the fleet, so new boat. Right. Older crew. And your son's been in the dinghy, in the dinghy race last Yes, my weekend, son yeah. was in the Optimist uh, race um, last, week. anyway. last weekend. So. Alright, but I'd better let you get back to finding out what's going on. Yeah? Thank you. Thank you. Unfortunately, our mark boats have gone to get out of the way. We need to get some long anchors and lines to 
we can get them out here. Itchy band saying that they don't think they'll be able to get out and they're looking at they want to try and get some plant to try and drag the boat up the beach. Do we have the um, the anchor line on the truck? Yeah, like the back of the truck is gone already. They're gone. Call yeah. call back, come back. Call them back. Call them come back. I you have to call the uh, contact now. Now PGM is looking for for shelter now. They can't they can't hold the anchor. They start the engine and looking for shelter. Oh it is. <laughs> So Jimmy and Pong, how many lines have they got on board? Not much, not much. Pin boats, pin boats. Pin line. They've got 100 meter lines. Yeah. I don't know how many they've got. They have no... See, if the Navy boat can go out to sea, yeah, get the puppets to come back. Yeah. We'll send an AD boat out to pick up some equipment. Yeah. I'll Make sure Jimmy and Paul have got enough fuel as well. Okay, the puppets will come back to you. Okay. And then what we need to do is we need maybe Chandran can maybe Chandran can help work with them. We need the seal boats. Yeah. We need the seal boats to go to the puppets and collect the anchors and the lines uh -huh. and then bring them back here and then we can start to do things. You can get like the, the starboard? Yeah, right? yeah. Um, and, um, they, 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 don't, they have already. I'm the organizing committee of the King's Cup Regatta. Have you ever seen anything like this before and in the many years you've been involved with the regatta? I've been involved in this regatta since the start, years ago, I've never ever seen anything like this. We have had maybe in that period in one boat with a uh, dragon's anchor and ended up checking the other two ships. It's uh, by comparison with that, it's a disaster. We've got to check out other boats uh, uh, on the beach or close to the beach. Um, hopefully, as you said, when the tide comes a bit back, uh, many of them will be able to be floated off. Now, there are some uh, right on the beach, some have uh, uh, broken their uh, rudders. Um, Hopefully there's no more serious damage, although it looks as though a couple of boats uh, have some serious problems. No loss of life, uh, nobody That's injured. That's the most important thing. Absolutely the most important thing. Uh, so far we haven't heard of uh, injuries, uh, which is uh, very good. You say so far, up it up. I mean, how, how do you check on everybody? We uh, are in touch with all of the owners, uh, all the skippers by radio, uh, by mobile phone. Um, and, uh, more boats uh, and drag their anchors and come in. Um, and hopefully the high tide will ease the situation a little and the storm is not going to last forever. It's lighter than it was very early in the morning. It started about 3 o'clock in the morning. So we get on the, on the boat to try and get hold of the boat. Um, we're doing what we can to uh, get boats back in the water. How much help do you have in the world? I know you're not just uh, together in the bay here and the best thing to do in that condition is if you can uh, to sail away and uh, into calmer waters uh, to another bay or at least out to sea. Of course today being the last day um, you were going to have a sail pass, uh, a ceremony, a traditional ceremony going past the Royal Thai Navy ship. I don't see the ship by the way. Uh, where, where is the ship, the Royal Thai Navy ship? 
Um, very sadly, we won't be able to do the sail past in honor of the King. Uh, the Navy ship has uh, left the bay for safety reasons, gone out to sea, as it totally should. There's nothing it could do uh, to help these, these, uh, these smaller boats. Um, and so the, uh, the sail past won't happen this morning, unfortunately. But also, you were going to have this new category of races for, what do you call it, IRC and in, or in uh, multi hole and one hole, yeah? Yes. Um, obviously, that's cancelled, right? Uh, yes, today's racing has been cancelled. Um, uh, luckily, the King's Cup series finished yesterday. We have a new format this year. Uh, so, races from uh, Monday to Friday counted towards the King's Cup, and today was going to be a, a special experimental one day series. Where all of the uh, uh, the boats raced in two fleets, the multi hulls and then all of the um, mono hulls racing uh, against each other for the first time, rather than only in classes. Unfortunately, again, that won't happen today. But perhaps in a way, you're lucky that the main regatta series then is finished. Yes, indeed. Uh, yes, there, there will be prizes presented tonight uh, by His Majesty's representative, and uh, at least that's something to look forward to. And of course, he also had the young dinghy sailors last weekend. We're certainly glad they're not out today. Right? We had a, uh, a series of four uh, weekend uh, races culminating last weekend. Um, and yes, that's all over. Those, uh, those positions have been secured. There will be prizes for the winners of, uh, of that series. And we should mention, of course, he also had the sad news on uh, was it, uh, Tuesday night, Wednesday night. One crewman died in his sleep, I think, on a boat. It's been a dramatic week. It has indeed been a dramatic week, yes. We're very sad about that sailor who uh, has, uh, uh, passed away during the night. Um, and uh, uh, we sent our condolences to his friends and family and are uh, waiting for more news on, the, uh, on, on what happened. Will there be a moment of silence for him and uh, in recognition? It may well be. I'm, uh, I'm not sure of the arrangements yet. Well, on the positive side, next year, will you change anything because of what's happened this year, do you think? Um, we will be um, making sure all of the skippers are aware of the potential uh, weather conditions. This was a very unusual storm that uh, hasn't happened before quite this way. Um, we will advise people to uh, make sure they have the appropriate ground tackle and anchors. Uh, perhaps some of them had uh, ground tackle that was a bit too light for what actually happened, but it's extremely unusual. Uh, we've never seen anything like this before in 24 years. So. And you wouldn't change the location or the date or uh, the rules? Certainly not. Uh, an unusual storm like this could happen any day of the year uh, in any place, so no, we won't be changing that. All right, thank you very much for coming to us, Chris. Thank you. Japan, right? Yes. And you're the owner of what's the boat called first? Pardon? What's the name of the boat? Tai Tai Two. Tai Two. Yes. Oh, tell us about the damage that uh, happened. Almost. I cannot. Cannot uh, repair. You cannot repair. Yeah, perhaps very bottom, very damage, big damage. Do you know how much it might cost? Pardon? How much it might have cost? This damage? I don't know. I don't know. Better. How much was yeah, the boat? New one. <laughs> new one. New one. Buy. Better. Was anybody on board the boat when it started? The storm started. Was anybody sleeping on the boat? No, no, no. Small. Because uh, every, uh, no problem. In, in the boat, no, 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 nobody. Right. Yeah. So everyone's safe. No injury. But they now are very dangerous, yes sir. Very dangerous. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here are very, very smoothly, no problem. But sometimes, uh, 
from our uh, little small spot. So the boat... Wave, 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 big wave. The boat forced it over, yeah, upside yeah, yeah, down. Yeah, yeah. Very crazy. Cannot anchoring. Will you come again next yeah. year? Ah, uh, with a different boat no, or new? No, no, no. Uh, not think no, about. No, 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 no. See. But my my team member, no damage, no body damage. Very important. All right. Okay. Okay. Thank, thank you. you. Cheers. ด้วยเรือยางดิงกี้เล็กๆนะครับประมาณ 4 เห็นว่าทางแก้ไขต่อไปเนี่ยตอนนี้นะครับเราส่งเรือยางเราไปเอาสมอที่เรือประพิษอยู่เพื่อเอามาให้ได้มากที่สุดแล้วจะเอาส
คุณคิดว่าอะไรเกี่ยวกับอากาศนี้อากาศอันตรายเห็นอย่างนี้อันตรายไหมกลัวไหมกลัวป่ะไม่กลัวนะเล่นได้ค่ะดิกีเล่นได้สู้อย่างนี้อย่างนี้ลิสมันเลยนะโอ้นี่ลิสมันเลยเพลงขึ้นด้วยไม่กลัวคุณยายจะไปเตียวนี่เก่งมากเก่งมากครับโอเคขอบคุณครับขอบคุณมากครับผมครับ